Okay, this is my spooky Arduino pumpkin. There's an Arduino inside it. I'll see if I can see through it. Let's see through somewhere. There's LEDs in there that are randomly flickering to look like the light. I've got a infrared distance sensor here to detect when someone walks up to it. Uh, power cable. I'm using USB right now, but I'll replace that. And then it's also hooked up to the speaker. I got an MP3 shield on it so I can play MP3s. And flash the lights. Here's the lights. Looking spooky. The LEDs are a little bit high so you can see them through the thing. Well, it's on the ground. It might not make a difference. Otherwise, I can put some wax paper over them or something to diffuse them a little bit. And so they just randomly flicker normally. And then when the IR sensor senses something, stepping in front of it, they flash, they play a sound and they flash with the sound. It uses a, uh, <clears throat> the MP3 shield has a built-in spectrum analyzer, so it uses the spectrum analyzer to get the frequency and flash the red and yellow based on that. So let's see a spooky sound. <laughs> Sounds like it, like lightning and ghost and a scary laugh. Let's see. I'll wait a minute and see if it'll play another one. It picks one randomly. Um, and I've got it set so it'll delay 20 seconds right now. So it'll only play one every 20 seconds at most. I'll probably up that to like 30 seconds or 40 or something like that. <coughs> I'll just <stand> <laughs> That's it. It was probably a whole lot of work for something that I could have bought for 10 bucks, but it was fun to do.